right, Lil Bam, what's going on? Shit, just chilling. Right, for sure, for sure, man. I mean, you've been on the blog site, you've been on Say Cheese, you know, a few times now, man. And, you know, when we posted you, you know, crazy response. Say Cheese is a very hard platform to get positive feedback. But, man, when you get great feedback on Say Cheese, that means something. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, where, where we at right now? We in Birmingham, Alabama? Yeah, in Birmingham. On the east side of Birmingham. Born and raised? Yeah. What what is it like growing up in, in, in Birmingham, Alabama? Shit. It's a it's a lot of it's a lot of different ways you can explain growing up in Birmingham. It depends on where you grow up at for real. Right, because I, I did a I did a pop up shop out there, man, and hey man, it niggas out there real serious, <laughs> man, you know. Yeah. I, I've seen I've seen it's, it. It's definitely that. Like it's always gonna be that. It's just I don't know. You just gotta get out first. That's my yeah, advice. You gotta get out first. You, <laughs> you did. Right. So, so basically, it's a lot of hating going on in Birmingham. Yeah, it's like you feel me. Niggas ain't really having shit. So when they see a nigga having shit, it's like I don't know why niggas feel like it ain't enough money for everybody. It's that's mostly what it be about. Most of the time, it be about some money. Sometimes it's about some dumb shit. Sometimes it's for no reason. But the shit that hell. Right, man. Now you know when I went out there, you know. It was a it was a crazy impact. I could tell that you know Birmingham doesn't really get you know the attention that it deserves. But it's a lot of people that's going up um, out of the out of the area right now, man. But what was your experience like growing up? What what did you, Lil Bam? What did you, what did you experience growing up in Birmingham? Shit, uh, nigga, nigga ain't had shit. So nigga really was just on some shit like having to take what I needed type shit. It was. Everything was straight though. I ain't never. I don't, I don't really know about how to explain what I went through. Cause I don't know how to talk about right. shit like that. Nigga was just right. always so you try not to really shit. talk about your past. You try not to talk about you know yeah. your past and shit like that. Uh huh. Right. I mean, shit. By what I see, man, and, and you know, I, I know. I check you out, man. I can tell by your videos. You really, you know, you really rapping what you, what you, what you living. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Definitely that. Right. Not like, 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 you know, these days, man, a lot of these rappers, man, you know, I could kind of tell that, you know, they not really rapping they with their living, but I can tell you really trying to get up, get out of the streets, you really trying to get out of Alabama and be successful so you can stop, you know, you know, being in the streets. Yeah. It's all it is. That's the, the whole, that's what it's all about. It ain't just about right. me, though. My folks, too. Yeah. Right. For sure. So, you know, I, I mean, have you been to jail, you know, in your past? Or, you you know, you've you been pretty clean? I went to jail one time, but I got a signature bond. I had a signature bond. That was my only time going to jail. Though. Oh, okay. 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 So, I mean, what, what, what's your take on the, on the Birmingham, you know, the rap scene right now? I feel like everything about to pick up. I see in the next couple of months, everything going to... Everything will be straight. You feel me? Next couple of months, it'll be a, it's gonna be a whole lot of names pop up that we ain't hearing about now. But I feel like it's gonna right. some shit though. All right. I mean, cause man, when, like I said, when I posted you on say cheese, man, you got a crazy, you got a crazy feedback, man. What, what was it like when you know when we posted you on, on the blog? Shit, I was happy as hell. Shit, I yeah. sit and watch um say cheese interviews in the house. So shit, that shit was like. You feel me? That shit motivation, like, to actually be on that shit. Okay. I mean, man, like I said, we post rappers all the time on Say Cheese, and, you know, a lot of times niggas don't be feeling it, but, you know, when you get on Say Cheese and you get a great fee great, great feedback, man, yeah. keep going, because, you know, Say Cheese is a hard platform, but, but once you get on there and move it, man, keep going. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. What, what's some artists you want to work with? Somebody like like locally or like just artist period. Yeah, just artist period. Um, I, I want to work with uh, Rallo Rodriguez. Shit. Um, the great young boy. Goddamn. It's a it's a long line of people. I can go on out there. I really want to work with a lot of people. 
I just did, um, I just finished the song with Young and Ace. So shit, that's my, my first major feature outside of the city. So that, like, I'm kind of excited about that shit. But it's a lot of people I want to get a chance to work with though. Cause I just like music, you feel me? I just like to make music, shit. Right, for sure, man. We, we, we play a big part in Birmingham. You know, we rocking with Love Soldier right now. Um, while being not mayor, we was on him real early. Now we now we rocking with you. Do you feel like you get the respect you deserve in your city as a rapper? Or do you feel like people still sleeping on you? Uh, it just started to come. Like, nigga, it's, it's respect, but it ain't what it should be. I've been I've been rapping for a minute, but I had to stop, though. But it's it's straight, though. The city love me. Like, I, I, I go on the mall and shit, like, everywhere I go, you feel me? They, they treat me like I'm a celebrity. I don't feel like I am, like... I still feel like a regular person, but yeah, I get low though. Right. Now, let's say you do blow up, you know, after these next few months, you know, let's say you, you blow up. I mean, are you are you moving out of Birmingham or, you know, you, you, you oh. staying? What you doing? Hell yeah. I'm going to get the hell on. That my, that my, my, first, my first thing I want to do, I want to get the fuck on. Right. Right, for sure. Now, um, why being our mayor, he's from Birmingham. Um, you know, he gets a lot of hate in, in the city of, of Birmingham. Yeah. Um, why, why do you think he gets so much flack in, in his own hometown? It's just, like, Birmingham a rough place. Like, when you when you come up, you know what I'm saying, the first thing people, people see, like, they want you to be this tough guy. Like, everybody got to be hard. You feel me? So it's, I guess him not being in, the, in no fight, like, him not being in the projects, type shit, them folk feel like they can play with him, but, I mean, I respect, bro, you feel me, he did his thing, he had his own shit going on, that shit, you feel me, can't make everybody like you, but now that he done blew up, you feel me, everybody like they support him, so you gotta watch that too, you feel me? Straight up, man, we had an event in um, Birmingham, and the shooting took place, you know, yeah. I don't like to name names, but a shooting took place. Um, have you ever been in, in any shootings or any, like, life, you know, life-threatening situations? Or, you, you know, you be clean? Shit, yo. I done been in plenty of shootouts, all kind of shit. I just got shot in July. You got shot in July? Yeah. Damn, wh wh where'd you get shot at? I here in the projects where I'm at now. No, I'm saying, like, you got oh, shot in your body. arm, your leg. Like, shit, I got hit in my leg, right up under my ass. Like, was it was it meant for you, or niggas was just shooting? Huh? Was it meant for you, or niggas was just shooting just randomly? It was just, it was, it was shot fired. It was just a, a, so, a big situation, like, you feel me? <laughs> so, 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 do niggas in your city want you dead, or what? Like, is it hatred like that, or is it, you know? Nah, that was on some shit that that happened right then. It was on some on site type shit. That shit happened then, and the shit popped off then. It wasn't on no shit like nobody was just planning to do shit to me type shit. Right. So, how many times have you been shot at throughout your life? Hell, yeah, long. I got. I can't count them motherfuckers. Would you say over ten? Would you say five times? I. It's definitely over five. Okay, so 10 times. You been shot around 10 times? He said been shot? Been no, I'm shot saying at? shot at. Been shot at a lot of times, but I, ain't, I only been shot once, though. Okay. Do, do, do you feel like, you know, is it karma? Like, is it something that you're doing to these people, or is it just real hate? <laughs> it's just burn me. I told you not to hit me. It's almost like... When you, when you grow up, like, around the shit I grew up around, you don't have no choice but to get in that shit. Because a nigga gonna fuck with you, you can't let a nigga fuck with you, so, you feel me? Like, even the young niggas, the young niggas around here got fire. It's just, everybody got some fire. It's just, it's just Birmingham. It's normal. I mean, but, you know, I, I could tell, you know, you, you walk around Birmingham freely. You know, when you when you in your city, do you watch over your shoulder, or you you not really too much worried about you know? I mean, you I, know, I the watch hatred. everywhere I go. You know, what I'm saying everywhere I go, I be alert, but not too much. Like I, I feel like I can go anywhere. I don't need no gun. 
all this shit. I ain't, I ain't worried about nobody doing that to me. It's just, you feel me? I be alert, though. I mean, of course I be on, gotta be on alert. Anybody can get touched, but I don't really too much be worried about nobody doing that to me. Right, for sure, man. Look, man, I'm fucking with you, man. Like, I, I really want to work with you, man. Like, I really want to do some shit, man. Like, I see the potential, um, you know, and you got the story. Um, but, um, you know, for the rest of 2018, what can we expect from Lil' Bam? Shit. I don't know. Don't expect shit. Just watch it happen. Don't right. expect shit. This shit just gonna, it's just, it's just gonna keep coming. Just watch it happen. Watch it unfold. That's all I need is eyes. As long as I got the eyes, I handle the rest. Right, most definitely. Um, is there anything else you want to let off your chest? Like, is there anything bothering you? Or is there anything you want to let your fans know? Is there anything you want to let off your chest before, you know, before we shake the spot? Is there anything you want to say? Shit. Uh. Man, shit. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. You pretty much you don't you don't do too much talking, man. You more of an action type of nigga. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't talk a lot. Like I ain't. So I don't really know how to answer questions. I'm working on it. Don't get better. Right, right, right. I mean. You know, you in the you in the projects right now, right? Yeah, I'm in the project right now. Is, is that is that like the area you from? Yeah, I I uh, I grew up here, Avondale. So so when you're in the projects, like what happens on a daily basis out there? Like y'all see the craziest shit? Shit, yeah. You see anything when you out here? <laughs> but the shit yeah. be so normal, like it'll be a shootout, bro. They like the folks still be just going by their everyday life, like ain't shit happening. Damn. This shit just so normal. Like, we hear gunshots and the shit just be like, ah, oh, shit, they shooting again. Or, damn, somebody got this so, damn pop. Do, 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 the, do the police give you a hard time? They don't, they don't really, shit, we barely see them. I think that's why most of the shit be going on, for real. Them bitches don't be doing shit. But they spend, they don't, they don't give us no hard time. They, they fuck with you. But, uh, no, they just spin through the projects, make sure when you sit on the block, that type shit. It's all. Uh, right. Like, does your mom, does your mom, is she concerned about your safety or, you know, she understand you grown, you gonna do what you wanna do? Me, she called me every day. She called me every day to make sure I'm straight and shit. If she hear anything about some shooting or something happened to anybody, she gonna call me. Ask me where I'm at, all kind of shit. You feel me? You never know who it is when you just gotta call your folks.